Now to tomorrow's Summer Extra, how to turn a hobby at home into a money-making small business. And we have a day on the racetrack to give you a thrill and improve your driving skills. Those stories and lots more when I'll be back with you again with Summer Extra tomorrow at 5.30. National Nine News is next up. Until tomorrow, have a great night. With Mike London and Samantha Coon, this is National Nine News. Thousands witness a spectacular fireworks display to welcome 1998. New Year miracle is toddler found floating in the broad water. A twin spin attack for Australia in the second test. Good evening. Queenslanders have seen in the new year with a bang. South Bank drawing the state's biggest crowd to witness its fireworks extravaganza. While the masses took to the streets, it was good-natured revelry. Police praising partygoers for making it a relatively trouble-free night. In what's become Queensland's biggest open-air party, 80,000 people set upon South Bank last night. Christine Spatiri, National 9 News. Coming up, another attack in Belfast. And the race to set a new hot air record. In the United States, Nick McCallum, National 9 News. Best of luck to them. Sport now with Sean and a milestone for Steve Watermore, Sean. Yes, Mike, a century of tests for Australia. His preview coming up and our champion women cricketers back with the booty. Jail for sale, but not everybody sold on the idea. There's only two prisoners have escaped in the last 54 years. Plus the couple who saw in the new year with style by getting married over Antarctica. They're next. Banner headline scored by two lengths. Second Y Kikamoo Cow. A real head. And that's me done for tonight. Thank you, Sean. <laughs> Layla's along with the New Year weather next. And Queensland's first baby of the year. <laughs> Hello and Happy New Year. The skies weren't too bright from Brisbane South today, which was good news for those suffering from last night's revelries. Sunny though on the Sunshine Coast, the river and the beaches looked beautiful. And Nine Chopper pilot Bob Ward enjoyed the view from his office. Cool in Ipswich and Logan overnight with 14 degrees, but maximums were average. It's more humid this evening and slightly cooler. Appearing at 30 seconds past midnight in the Toowoomba Base Hospital. And happy birthday, Emma. And that's the news on this New Year's Day. We'll leave you with images of the fireworks over South Bank. Good night. Good night. Hi and thanks for joining us for another year of A Current Affair. And tonight, the young lovers who saw in the new year in style, eloping for a secret wedding high above Antarctica. The parents don't actually know yet. <laughs> <laughs> so they're in for a bit of a shock. We'll have to wait for our champagne till we get home, obviously, but apart from that, we're happy, aren't we? We're waiting oh. for a drink. Oh. Oh. You may now kiss your wife. Oh. And a more controversial relationship. Woody Allen marries his former stepdaughter and despite the stormy headlines, he has no regrets. It was always media craziness. I'm very happy and Sunni's very happy <coughs> and uh, conceivable that we would have children. Woody Allen a little later, but first...